Hey guys, uh, just wanted to say a quick hi and um, just let you know I went out and about today to run some errands and um, actually went to some natural natural food stores that um, I love to go to to get some some different favorites and um, I was truly in awe of the contrast um, that I felt and how different things have become and I just really wanted to kind of just spark some some thoughts uh, about free will and choices that we have and what we want our our world um, the one that we live in to be and what kind of world do we want to design um, I want you to know that everything that's being um, recommended is truly a recommendation. It's suggested. We have free will. We have choices. And it's for each one of us to decide what feels natural and is best for us. And um, I noticed um, most people are just complying and it's not just that they're complying I am really sensing that people are truly suffering I love to go out and about and I love to interact with folks I love to connect it's just one of my favorite things to do it just fills me up I mean talk about energy I mean God really knew what he was doing when he he encouraged and created opportunity for a community to, to come together and to support one another. That's what humans are designed to do. And I noticed when I was out and about, it is challenging to connect with people. Um, people are definitely not engaging in eye contact as much. Um, they're definitely, you, you can't see a smile. I mean, I, I am, uh, you know, breathing freely when I'm out and about. Um, that's my choice. And um, I engage with others and try to um, just, you know, smile and encourage them. And it's just falling away. Um, I'm not feeling that connection um, as much. And guys, I really want us to think, um, is that okay? Is that what we want? Is that what safety is? Um, is that security? Is that what we're here to do? Are we here to like feed each other, you know, with, with love and energy and encouragement and have that human connection? Um, it's definitely different. And, you know, that makes me sad. It really does. And so... It's really creating a contrast, guys, and, and we have a choice. And it's up to each person to take action and do what's best for them. Um, but I do miss it. I miss the connection. I miss the energy. Um, I miss getting to know each other in the store. And, and, you know, I'm in the Midwest, and that's something I really took pride in, um, being in the Midwest. Uh, people are friendly here. Uh, they're very lovely. And I've been to multiple places the last couple days. And I'm noticing a big change. Um, and, and it's concerning to me. Um, so if, if you're feeling the same. And you haven't quite figured out like how to really honor yourself. Or honor what your truth is. I want you to know you have a choice. Um... This can all be for good, guys, and I really do believe transformation is happening and people are waking up and deciding what freedom means to them and what health means to them and what community means to them. Uh, lo loving your neighbor, what does that mean? Loving yourself. All those are very important things that we've all been raised to talk about, um, but now it's like... Who are we becoming? Um, 
my prayers are uh, just constant as everyone is uh, constantly feeling this shift and this um, difference but um, guys it's time it's time to really take our power back and to align with each other and design the world that we want um, I'm going to keep spreading joy I'm going to keep uh, living in the knowing that I know that God God is my protector and, and my immune system is is a miracle and I will honor that and I will constantly um, continue to feed that because we do have innate power we have it it's within us um, so if you're feeling the fear of, of, of not being able to keep up or do that take the first step I mean that's what this is all about transformation and becoming better on the other side of all this, right? So, I just really had to speak on this. I, I've i just watched, especially in the heat, um, the vitamin D is just so uh, healing and so powerful for your immune system. And I encourage you guys, you know, soak it up. Um, feed yourself. That's, that's what we were um, blessed with all these tools for. Uh, so we could do it, you know, in a more natural, aligned way. So, I am here. If you're interested in, hey, Jennifer, like, how do I do this, you know? I'm not feeling aligned. I'm not feeling, I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired of it. Um, reach out to me. I would love to help you and support you on this journey. Um, we're all given an opportunity, guys, to wake up and to live freely as God created us to. So we all have compassion for one another and we, and we totally love one another for where we're each at. No judgment. Please don't take this as that. It's just something I witnessed and experienced. And, and I uh, came outside and just really spent some time in nature because I noticed... I love to be outside because it is natural and that is where truth is. Um, we went to a beautiful sunflower field yesterday and, and everyone was just living freely and just having a wonderful time with their families and, and just soaking it up and then going to a place, you know, that's supposedly a natural state where people are focused on getting stronger and building their immune system and, and I felt a lot of fear and I felt a lot of mandates and and judgment um, I still stayed in my truth and I've been blessed I mean that's just you just do what's right for you and it will all be well um, but I felt a huge contrast so you know I encourage you to keep doing what's right for you um, but let's begin to ask ourselves you know what kind of action do I want to take and that means your your individual action like, I'm not talking protesting or doing any big, you know, rally type thing. That's all great. But it's actually walking in your daily life. You know, what, what is right for you? What action are you taking? How are you living? That's the power. And guys, we can multiply this thing. We are meant to be magnetic. We are meant to um, empower each other. Uh, we're not meant to repel. We're not meant to um, isolate ourselves or disconnect. That, that's, what, that's what the dark energy, that's the dark force, whatever that is. That's what they want. Nah, no. Jesus said, gather. God wants us to be congregating. He wants us to be in communion together, living life together. So anyways, uh, thanks again. Um, I love y'all. Have an amazing day. Like I said, I've got some amazing activation tools. Activating. Empowering your own selves to be your best. Um, and I'd love to share them with you if you're open. Um, just keep the hope, guys. Keep sharing love. And most of all, feeding yourself whatever is, is right for you. And however you live. Uh, that's your gift. That's your gift. So... Gonna go on a quick bike ride with my kid and um, just soak it up. So grateful.
so grateful for this moment and uh, things are looking up guys take care